Ghana rolled out the red carpet for Prince Charles and Camilla on Friday, as they jetted into Accra on day three of their royal tour of West Africa. The royals stepped onto the tarmac at Kotoko International Airport to the sounds of a military parade, and the Duchess of Cornwall, who shielded herself from the powerful African sun with a parasol, was presented with a colorful bunch of flowers on the red carpet. Charles and Camilla were officially welcomed by the Ghanaian president, Nana Akufo-Addo, and the first lady, Rebecca Akufo-Addo, at the presidential palace, Jubilee House. The couple touched down in Ghana from the Gambia, where a glittering black tie reception was held in their honor, at the Coco Ocean Hotel on Thursday night. The Duchess of Cornwall was resplendent in a pistachio green kaftan style gown for the event, while her husband was dapper in a double-breasted navy suit. On Friday Camilla had opted for a floaty cream dress, nude heels and a basket effect bag to make the trip to Ghana, while Prince Charles wore a khaki suit and military badges. Both wore remembrance poppies to mark the upcoming Armistice Day. Later Charles was joined by his brother Prince Edward, where they laid wreaths, at the Christiansborg War Cemetery. Their Royal Highness were escorted through the Memorial Garden, and received by the President, where they paid their respects to the fallen.